Not so high and mighty now, are you? Welcome back to The Legend of Zelda, Phantom Hourglass, where I am on the Gust Island, and it's time to deal with that. That ought to be fun, right? Hello, you stupid goblin things. Who wants to die? Strong wind we've got, huh? He, she could fall into the ocean at any point. Of course, that's the point. That's the idea, isn't it? Jerks. Dang it. Ah, there we go. Ooh, nice. That's what I was looking Ah, man! That was bad timing right there. You like the wind, huh? How about a hurricane? Dang it. Now I'm no longer at full health again. That sucks. All because of a mistimed jump. Ooh, and now I'm full of hearts. Don't go breaking my heart, don't go breaking my heart. Oh, whoops, maybe I should have read that first before destroying it. Frick. At least I got a little off here. Douchebag. Okay, now you're gonna get it. It's time for the hurricane. Uh-oh. Uh, ah, crap. Okay, mis misplaced there. Remember, tap. Don't press the buttons. It is very counterproductive, to say the least. Nice. What's this? You got a courage gem! Okay, cool. I forgot what those were for. Wait, what's this all about? Hold on. Wayfarer's Journal. You never know where the wayfaring winds will take you next. After months upon this windy isle, I discovered smaller islands nearby. But my big discovery, the one that my, sets my heart aflutter, the mermaid. That is where my wayfaring destiny takes me next. Okay. Is this about a mermaid? Possibly. Okay, clearly you gotta do an arrow right here and an X right here. And if I'm reading this correctly, an X in this general direction. Okay then. I'm not really sure what that's about, but I'm guessing it's gonna be something important later on. Possibly. Frickin' wind. Oh, right, there's a fence there. Whoops. I'm guessing I can't go any further. Maybe if I re actually read the sign to see what it says. Yeah, wait until the, wait until the wind dies. Strong wind warning, don't get blown off. Thanks. Thanks a lot. I'm guessing we can't do anything more here have to set apart for the open seas, you know? Yes, indeedy. I don't see anywhere else to go, to be honest. So, let's try it. Leaving! I got you all the way out here, now you're stuck or something? With all this wind around, there's got to be a way forward. Yeah, you little green parrot. Go ride the wind when you feel a breeze at your back. But if you really want to go, should I raise anchor? Hey, why? We worked so hard to get all the way out here. Do you really want to leave this island already? Fine, get on board then. We're setting sail. Shut up, Lineback. I found a sea chart. It's gonna help our journey, probably. So, just shut up. 
Shut up, mulatto. And we off. At least he ultimately agreed to it. It's time to... Uh-oh. It's a enemy ship. Well, that was easy. Didn't have a chance. Oh, gold frog. Crap. Come on, come on, hit it. It's actually harder than it looks. You have to hit it precisely. Oh, don't be a douche. There you go. Oh, okay. It gets you more rupees the more you hit it. That's cool. Bannon Island. I'm sure there's something here that will help me. Probably, maybe. Old of Wayfarer's house. Awesome. Hello. Oh, this is the place for those who hunger for the romance of adventure. This is the Wayfaring Island, young man. Ha ha ha. So, go on, tell me. Did you find it? It. Hey, now. You can tell me there are no secrets between men of adventure. You came to the distant island in search of the elusive beast, the mystical creature that bewitches sailors from the waters of this island. You came in search of the mythical mermaid, right? Huh? What? Wayfarers must be always be looking for adventure. In my search for the mystical creature, the mermaid, I sacrificed many of life's pleasures, friends, family, good snacks. I gave it all up to search for the mermaid. Take this pool, for example. This is, that is where the mystical creature will lounge once I capture her. This pool costs a hefty fortune for a man who follows his wayfaring hard. You are young. With age, I have learned to approach life's quest with passion. So, young man, if you see a mermaid, you'll tell me right away, won't you? We men of adventure must stick together. Well, if he gave up tasty snacks, he must be dedicated. I mean, come on. What kind of non-passion person would do that? Just saying. I wonder if he ever bothered to check this cave. Only those with the power to shatter rock will find the path to a new game. Okay, in other words, you need a bomb. Did I just waste my time coming here? I get the feeling I just wasted my time coming here and I should have stayed at the Isle of Gust. Oh, uh, okay. Link didn't quite have it in him. Dang. There are never any hearts when you need them. It's the weird little islands like this that have treasure. Wanna set sail, kid? Yeah, I guess. I guess I'll go back to the Isle of Gust, why not? Actually, we should make a hard turn over it. That way we don't hit anything, you know? Where's that gold frog? Oh wow, did I just blow up that seagull? Awesome. Oh crap, now there are two of them. Freaking ships. Only room for one ship, mulatto. And that would be me. Burn. And the firing ember of your horrible mistakes. It's funny how vertical these islands are when you actually look at them. And yet when you actually go on them, they're fairly flat. I know why that is, of course. That's so that your movement is impeded so much. It has to be flat to make sense to the player, you know? And to the gameplay mechanics. But I'm guessing that shows the islands as they actually are. Which is kind of cool. At least in my opinion. Okay. It's a good thing I didn't go a second sooner. It simply stopped me from jumping altogether. Do not jump when the wind is about to come. Otherwise, you're you're really boning yourself at that point. There's got to be something here. Okay, I know the limit of what's too much. And that would have been too much. Okay, now I understand. 
I'm supposed to use the wind to propel me forward. That makes sense. There we go. Of course, I should have realized that from the beginning. What's wrong with me? It became so clear when I was actually looking for it. But I saw the sea chart and I just assumed, well, I guess I gotta go, you know? What's in here? Hello. You can die now. You have outlived your usefulness, fool. I see. Okay, then. Take this, you pricks. Take this. I'm not gonna let you idiots get anywhere near me. Of course, I will slaughter all of you before I claim the treasure. It only seems proper, you know? Dang it. They're very good at eluding me, aren't they? Whoa. As a reward, I get two treasures. What do we have here? You got a wisdom gem! It can't be used like this. Of course not. You got a treasure map! Sweet! Too bad I can't use it for anything. Wait, please tell me that it... That it actually made itself appear. Okay, good. <laughs> I didn't have to write anything down. It did it for me. Awesome. That's so cool. What is this? Hello, what's all this then? This is to show the player this is possible. Introduce the mechanic. I figured that's how it worked. And now, you have to make your own. Oh. I see. Nice. 100 rupees. Now that is generous, my friend. Now that is fit for a captain! It is. Prick. These are a bunch of douchebags, they are. However, I will get past it and I will prevail. Because I have the heart of a warrior or something. You cannot defeat me that easily. The thought makes me laugh. Oh, okay. Stupid prick. Not so tough and not so high and mighty now, are you? Wait, what? Oh, okay. Right, it, it glitches sometimes. Cool. I'm guessing this one is the one that I actually want. Nope. Well, crap. I was hoping that one of them would be a wind gust. Oh well, doesn't matter. I found... I found the way... F no, I didn't. Now I'm back at the friggin' beginning. What's wrong with me? Many things, but let's focus on the important. Not wanting to look at my map. That's one thing that's wrong with me. I rely on my eyes too much. And I am impulsive. Well, we've discussed my character flaws. Okay. Take me away. I don't want to risk it. I don't want to waste any... I don't want to waste more time. Because that would suck. Okay, I'm guessing that was the way forward and I just didn't realize it. My bad. Well, at least they stay dead. So that's cool. Now then. It is time to move forward. Of course. You, you just do what you did before. What the? Ah, here it is. Ah, what do we have here? I take it I have to go to several areas to turn off this wind gust. The temple entrance stops gusting only when windmills have had their fill. Okay. That's not good, is it? 
I get the feeling that's gonna make things very complicated for me. What in the world? What in the world is this? What do you think those are, Med Drunk Link? All those spots on the ground. Looks like they were shoveled in with dirt. Yeah, what do you think? You just barely see them, too. Because of the glitching. Go away, you little freaks. Link, don't you know how to put it? You've got a power gem! More gems that I can't use. Hooray! I'm so happy for that. In fact. Dang it. I was gonna get that blue rupee. But it got away. Let's just go straight to heck. Nice. Good thing I just happened to randomly dig right there. <laughs> so helpful. Let me guess. Now I gotta do the opposite. Yep. It's teaching you how to use mechanics properly. What's this? The hero must blow on three sacred windmills to press open the path forward. Awesome. Wait. Map. Okay, so... Here. Here. On the... Here. That looks terrible. Looks like I'm calling upon Q. And I don't need the power- I don't need Q's help just yet. He's probably too busy messing with Picard anyway. Yes, that will be lovely. Now I just have to find these windmills. Dang it. There we go. Dang it! Link, you gotta quit embarrassing both of us. There we go. Thank you, Link, for finally realizing what I meant to do. Ah, look at that. Ding dong! Creatures that are sensitive to sound dwell in the sands ahead, so walk without sound and bring your s as little attention to yourself as possible. The falls fails, flee to a high spot before the creatures find you. I see. Very interesting. Oh boy. I don't think so, pal. What do you got? What information do you have for me? The sand creatures devour whatever they find, so feed them bombs. Then you'll have a chance of survival. Okay, whatever works, pal. Nice. <laughs> Take that, you stupid prick. Not so high and mighty now, are you? You moron. There you go. <laughs> That's one hot tamale. That's just awesome. All right, this isn't one. This isn't one of the special ones. I should say not. Uh oh. Oh, that was close. <laughs> nice. Kaboom! Not looking so tough now, are you? Wait, this might be one. Hold on. Okay, there we go. I am convinced that that has to be one of them because there's no other ones around here. You got a treasure map. And yes, this blowing actually does work. Even on this. Ooh, nice. Heart. Did you grab the freaking heart already? Dang it. Well, that sucks. Freaking hearts that I can't even get. Man. 
Oh, you're gonna pay for this. Ah, crap. I blew myself up. And I'm about to get eaten! You stupid prick. You're gonna pay for that. When I'm done blowing myself up, that is. Revenge time, mother effer. Oh, revenge is so sweet. When I actually pull it off. Eat it! You gotta be kidding me. You have got to be kidding me. No, no, no! No, 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 no! You gotta be freaking kidding me! I accidentally clicked out of the freaking window, damn it! Okay, good. At least he can pick up the freaking jars and actually make use out of them. Okay, second one. Sorry. But that's the only way. I mean, I guess I could mute myself, but... Eh. I'm just demonstrating that it actually does work. Eat this! Hope you enjoyed it. It's very spicy. There. Those should be the three. Yes, indeed. Excellent. And now, the way to the temple should have been cleared. Yes, indeed. Awesome. Temple of Wind. We're finally inside, Link! Looks like we won't escape sudden gusts inside the temple either, be careful! That's for sure. Uh-oh. Really? Oh, I know exactly what to do. Oh, right. I should probably use my boomerang for this. Try this on for size. Oh. Does that not work? Wait, can I jump across that? No, of course not. What it wants me to do is this. Wait, what? Ah, crap. Okay. Try this. Didn't work. Okay, I just want to confirm that I can't jump it. I don't know what to do, to be honest. Do I have to do it without blowing them up? Because that's probably going to be impossible. Yep, impossible. How am I supposed to do this? If it even touches them, it explodes. Okay, so if it's already armed, it doesn't do a thing. This is getting tricky. Let me guess. Okay, I can't even dig anything. Link, what are you doing? You trying to make yourself fall off the edge again? You moron? I don't understand. This puzzle legitimately has me stumped, which means... Hang tight real quick. Somehow that randomly worked. You just gotta keep throwing it until somehow he just throws it far enough. Doesn't really make any sense, but okay. That was just messed up. That was straight up messed up. You know what? Let's just do this. Link, can you just hold on to the block? That'd be great. I see. Cool. That's all fine and dandy. At least I have enough health to not be beeping now. 
Hello. How's it going, buddy? What the? What's all this then? Hello, what's all this then? Okay, I can't jump off, of course. Obviously. So there has to be an alternate route. Something that I'm not seeing. That bomb has something to do with it, I'm sure of it. I see. Oh, okay, cool. The wind has stopped now. Let's just make Link hold on to it. That would make, that'd be a lot easier, you know? Even with just touch screen all the controls, it doesn't make any sense. Link, what the hell are you doing? Jeesh. You'd think it would take a little more prompting before he decides to just run off to his death. Like that. But nope. Link is apparently eager to do it. Okay, that was a stupid idea. I don't know what inside of me convinced me that I would be able to carry that bomb fast enough. But clearly that side of me is an idiot. Which is most of me. Okay, clearly I'm lost again, so hang tight real quick. And of course the answer was simple. Well, of course I could have just pressed it open. Why didn't I just try that? Because I just assumed it wouldn't be that simple. My mistake. Clearly, I overestimated things just a tad. I made the erroneous assumption that if you see locked doors, that they wouldn't be child's play. I mean, just literally no effort to open. You just tap them open. Maybe the game is messing with me, who knows? Well, it's a, it's a fight, clearly. There you go. Well, it wasn't that easy. Okay, cool. I understand you want to go through the cinematics, but... Okay, there's a like-like in here somewhere. Don't fall for it. Let's see what happens when I use this. Oh, okay. So it wasn't a trap. This game is messing with me, isn't it? Made me think it was a friggin' trap. It's a lot more straightforward than I would have thought. See, my logic was no, there's no way. It has to be something more sinister than this. What the hell? What the heck is that? What in the world are those two squares, and what do they represent? Dang. Okay, clearly not a smart idea. What do you have to say? The number of treasure chests left here is one. It'll cost you 20 rupees to see where the treasure lies. No thanks. That's your loss, or is it? Good luck. Thanks. Thanks a lot. Now then. Hmm. You know what? I have no... I have no clue, so... I'll go ahead and pay the fee. Fine, tell me. Thanks a lot. I saw it already, but... Okay. Your advice was worthless. Okay, what's over there? And most importantly, how do I get over there? That's gonna be the tricky part. Wait, can I just move this? You can move this! Well, good to know! Holy crap! I didn't know that was possible! Learn something new every day, huh? I've played Phantom Hourglass before, but it's been forever, to be honest. I love it when it creates shortcuts, it's very nice. Uh-oh.
to my enemy. Let me guess, they're hiding in the rocks, aren't they? Dang it, I was hoping to pick them up. Oh, you son of a... I hit the right button, I know I freaking did. I hit the E button, that's supposed to be the interact button. That's screwed up, man. Yeesh. Talk about the game just not knowing what to do. It's because the game doesn't use physical controls naturally. So, it takes a little bit of adjusting. There you go. You know, good crook. Take this. Ha, take that. Not so high and mighty now, are you? Unfortunately, I'm all out of time, so... As my life ebbs away and comes back to me, easy come, easy go, I shall say... That is it for now. Thank you so much for tuning in with me. Make sure to spread this video around like splatter chump, splatter jelly, f jelly freak. And I will see you next time. Now go out there and capitalize on life. Peace out, have a good one, and have a nice and pleasant day. If you enjoyed the content and want to stay up to date, I upload 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time every single day. You can also subscribe and hit the bell icon or just check out the end screens right here.